In this vlog, I'm going to be showing you guys how I grew out my daughter's hair. I started using these two ingredients in March, about three months ago, and there has been significant difference in how her hair looks. Before now, I was using um, just normal regular drugstore products. They were doing fine, but merely I introduced these two ingredients. Oh my God. <sighs> that has just been different. Let me show you guys her hair. So you guys, this is what her hair looks like at the moment. This is all her hair. I had to tie it because we're coming out. And yeah, so today is Saturday. Today is wash day. I am going to be washing her hair and be using those ingredients and I'm going to carry guys along. But first of all, we are here to buy um, breakfast, pizza. We're here to buy breakfast because today is Saturday and I'm not gonna cook, okay? Alright, so if you see me for the first time, my name is Agos. I live in Oka Anambra State and I basically make vlogs just sharing my life, my family. So if you want to see the ingredients I use to grow out my daughter's hair, Please keep on watching. I'll see you guys soon. So guys, these are basically the ingredients I use. The first one is onion and the second one is eggs. Okay, so basically what I do, I just crack the eggs and I blend them together with the onions. Added more water to the eggs so the onions will see what they will blend with. Okay, so that's it. I just try to blend it as much as possible so that I don't have so many large chunks of the onions I'm not even gonna lie, this thing stinks, okay? It stinks! <laughs> you know how onions already has a strong stench and then add egg to it? But it does wonders, so we're not gonna mind the stink. So what I'm going to do up next is to use it on my daughter's hair. I use this as a mask, first of all. Some people try to sieve it just to sieve out the onion water or to sieve out some water and fry it to get onion oil. I don't do that. I just basically pour everything because even the back of that onion, all those things, we need it. So I just pour everything into her hair, sectioning her hair. I use this onion and egg solution or these two ingredients to actually detangle her hair. Because as you guys can see, she has a lot of hair. So when I lose out or take out her braids, I don't really like to just comb the comb her hair out immediately.
at this point i am detangling her hair it is always good for you to detangle the hair while you still have the mixture i haven't detangled this hair prior to now i just put the product and left it for 45 minutes like i showed you guys and i am detangling the hair right now i'll go ahead and wash her hair with the normal drugstore products that i use i'm going to leave a link in the description box if you want to see how i use these products to wash her hair mommy say hello to the camera hello. look at us now do you like your hair? What do you have to say to mommy? Thank you. You're welcome. So that's how I achieved my daughter's long and strong hair. The onion and egg mixture will help to stop any form of breakage and it also softens the hair and it will also lead to longer healthy hair. I have two other things I also like to add. First of all, for my daughter, I don't allow any other person to take out her braids. So anytime she braids her hair, I am the one that takes out her braids because some other person might not be as careful as I am and that might lead to her hair breaking and all that and the other thing I also do is that it's just one person that braids her hair of course I don't braid her hair <laughs> I don't braid her hair we always have someone that comes to the house to braid her hair and that's what we have been doing we have always stopped to one person so if you want to achieve long healthy hairs in as much as you would like to have long good healthy hair you also need to watch out for all those things because there is no point of treating your hair, treating your scalp and at the end of the day you go to braid your hair and you mess up your hair. So that's all I have for you today. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you don't yet subscribe and I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Bye.